Hello, Slim Down family. Yes, we canceled today's walk. And I know that may be a little bit of a downer because you're accustomed to going out and walking with some of your friends. But after I heard what the weather was going to be like, how cold it was going to be like, the advisory basically said that it's best for you to remain inside. So I thought it would be best to just have you stay inside today, stay warm, stay safe. But I didn't want to leave you high and dry. So I have a little workout that you can perform with me. I'm going, to I'm going to do two rounds. If you decide that you want to do more rounds, then you'll be able to do it on your own as well. So follow me. It's going to be very simple. All you need is a chair. If you have an exercise ball at home, whether it be dumbbells, a bowl, a bar, um, let me see, a gallon of milk. And we know we got to have a gallon of milk because when the weather gets bad, everybody goes and gets the bread and the milk but just something that has a little bit of weight to it. So all we're gonna do is a series of exercises. We'll probably do six or seven, let's say seven, and it'll be very, very simple, stuff that you can do. Okay, so follow me. We're gonna be doing 12 reps of each. So the first exercise is going to be squats. So I'm gonna use a chair as a reference to what I need to be, to how far I need to go down. So it's gonna be simple. You're gonna sit on the chair, stand up without using your hands. So it's one, Two, three, four, five, join me, six, seven, eight, and nine, I'm going to slow down a little bit, and ten, eleven, and twelve, so that's your first exercise, so now, I'm going to go to the back of the chair. If you can do the push-ups on the floor, that's the exercise we're doing on the floor, then that's fine. If not, you can use the back of the chair that you were using for your squats. So you're going to hold on to the back, inhale down, and exhale. Once again, we're going to do 12 push-ups. Inhale, two, three, four, five, six, good. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, last one, and twelve. The next exercise we're going to do is curls. So if you have weights, no problem. You'll be bending at the elbow, bringing the dumbbells up towards your chin. But if you do not have weights, a bar, use a gallon of milk, I'm going to do the exercise ball. So, I'm going to hold the ball down, exhale, bend at the elbow, bring it towards the chin. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, inhale, exhale, seven, eight, and nine, give you a different angle, ten, eleven, and twelve. Next exercise is going to be shoulder press. So I'm going to use, I'll use the dumbbells this time, just to show a difference. I'm going to sit down on the chair, give you a different perspective. You can do this standing up as well. So I'm going to start here with the dumbbells at ear height. I'm going to exhale and push them straight up over my head. Inhale, exhale, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, last one, and twelve. Okay, so next exercise, I'm going to perform on the chair as well, a tricep extension. For those arms, some of my female clients call them bye-bye arms, grandma arms. This exercise works that area. And it's a tricep extension. I'll use the ball. I'm going to do twelve of them again. You're going to extend the weight, the ball, the bar over your head like this. Keep the elbows tight and together. Bend the elbows and bring the weight behind your head. And then from here, exhale, extend up. So, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11 and 12.
All right. So the next exercise is a really basic exercise that we have been performing. And that we definitely did them in my class. Jumping jacks. We're only going to do 12. I'm going to move this stuff out of the way here. So we have different ways of doing them. We have the conventional way, which is out, in, or the modified, which is one foot out, next foot out, and in. Foot out, foot out, and in, foot out, and in. Each one of those counts as one. So I'm going to do 12 of them. I'll do the conventional way, but you do them whichever way makes sense for you. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Last exercise is the butt kick, which is running in place. Okay? It's really simple. I'll give you this angle. Every time we step with both the left and the right equals one. So we're going to do a total of 24 steps which in this case counts as 12 repetitions. So once again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. So if you just had to step up and do a march, if that works for you, then fine. So we're done with our first round. So I'm gonna do the second round. You can follow with me without explanation. I'm just gonna do it. So once again, follow with me. We'll do our second round together. So, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And 12. So normally you would take a break, but we're going to try to keep our breaks just for the transition in time that it takes to go from one exercise to the next. So now we're into push ups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12. All right, now we're gonna do our curls. Uh, I'm gonna do the curls with the ball. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. All right, so back to shoulder press. I'm going to give you shoulder press from this angle this time so you can see what it looks like from this angle. So once again, it's 12. One, using the ball. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and 12. All right, tricep extension. I'm gonna keep it at the same angle. This time, I'm gonna use the dumbbell. So if you have one dumbbell, you can actually hold them with one hand. Assuming that one dumbbell we're talking about is not a person. All right? All right, so start with the dumbbells over your head, same situation, bend at the elbow. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna change the angle so you can see it a little bit different. Like this, good. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Very nice. All right, so let's go back into our jumping jacks. Remember, modified. Let me move this ball. Modified is one step, out and in. Conventional, two feet at the same time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So without break, I'm gonna go right into the butt kick. Now if you needed to take a break in between, that's fine. All right, so we'll do the march one. One, two, three, four, Five, six, I'm going to 
gonna break it to the conventional one. Why not? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So there you have it. You have your workout for today. I demonstrated two rounds. So if you want to do more rounds, just go back to the beginning of the recording and do the other ones. So there's no excuses. You have everything you need at home, chair, ball, weight, even a gallon of milk, gallon of water. Either one will work. All right? So make it happen. And we'll see you next week at the YMCA. Take care. Be good. Put your heart and soul in your goal. Be well.